Welcome back everyone. Well, we're looking at plenty of chances for rain this week. Today we could see some late day showers, more rain possible tomorrow. Wednesday is going to be the day to watch for some widespread rain and it could be an all day rain with some thunderstorms in the mix. 20% chance on Thursday should dry out late this week and looking pretty dry for Mother's Day weekend as well. We have some sunshine right now, so that's a welcome sight. 54 degrees, a little breezy out there, but all in all, a pretty nice start to your Monday morning. Cold front that uh, sparked those thunderstorms yesterday afternoon. That has since pushed into southeast Iowa, and it's going to camp out over Kansas and Missouri today. So last week we thought this front might lift back north and provide us a chance for severe weather. That's not in the cards now. We're not going to see severe weather today in Iowa. There will be some storms in Kansas, Missouri, down to Oklahoma and Texas, though, but it looks like we'll avoid the strongest of the storms here in Iowa. We had some rain overnight. Des Moines got a quick shower around midnight last night. A little bit of rain lingering around Highway 20, but recently that has really fallen apart. So pretty much everyone will start off today dry. Should be dry most of the morning and then late this afternoon into the evening. Central and southern Iowa will have a chance at some showers and maybe some weak thunderstorms. Best chance for storms will be in southern Iowa. That threat will continue through the evening and overnight tonight. We could wake up to some showers tomorrow morning in Des Moines. I think a lot of tomorrow will end up being dry, but early and then again late Tuesday we'll have an opportunity for some more rain. Here's Wednesday and it just keeps on coming a, little while, a lot of rain heading our way and that should continue through Wednesday afternoon, maybe lingering into Wednesday night before we finally dry out on Thursday. So rain totals between now and Thursday morning could be in the one to three inch range for a lot of central and western Iowa that could swell up our rivers and lead to some river flooding in central Iowa. It's not going to be to the extent they've seen on the Mississippi or the Missouri, but certainly minor flooding is possible. Back to today, 64, our forecast high will drop to 48 overnight tonight with a chance for some light rain showers in central and southern Iowa. And again, that threat just keeps on rolling. That's going to keep your highs in the low 60s tomorrow, 50s in the forecast Wednesday into Thursday, and we'll gradually warm back up for the tail end of that 10 day tracker 70s by this time next week.